All right, welcome back to the channel, guys. Uh, before the video do, the blah, 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 I'm gonna keep that in. Before the video does start, uh, I just want to let you guys know that my server recently wiped, and that's what this video is going to be made on. We are playing it, so pops a little low. So let's get pop up there. Please come join. It's Xbox Windows 10, five times service, twenty times XP, uh, fifty times hatch and mature speed, all that. Six man tribes, ally, infinite weight. There's all maps except for score stars. Score stars may be added very soon. But yeah, it's fresh white pretty much. I mean, it's been up, I think, for like a week when this video comes out. All the good spots are still there. The pop is kind of low. I mean, we're averaging like 15, 20, 25 people. I would really like to get the pop up. So if you guys do play on Xbox or Windows 10, come give it a try. It's a fun PvP server. And yeah, let's get right into the video. It's going to be day one on the server. So it was day one, so you know what that means. We had to claim our base spot. Um, the, the rest of the tribe, my uh, wife and my best friend, went to Crystal Isles to get some uh, wyverns and stuff. I just got a quick PT tame. I went and split him some foundations at one of the best caves, in my opinion. Not the best, but one of the best. We're going to claim oil cave this wipe. And yeah, I got some foundations there, but I needed to get some metal. So we're going to farm up some metal. We're going to take it back to base. Come on, give me something good. I'm hoping this yellow drop gives me something good. Uh, I got a shotgun at the yellow drop. Got like four forges full of like 500 to 1000 metals melting up. Definitely gonna need to get all these full. Alright, I gotta make the generator for the turrets. Uh, Alright, I have some in the fabricator, but we're gonna need more. Um, get the gen. Gotta make some ammo for that turret. the stuff we're gonna need to put a couple turrets here so if you do see somebody blowing in the gates if I'm not here just hop on the there's you know and just try to kill them So we are finally getting some process, uh, progress made. We were finally getting to the point where we could place a couple autos, so I'd feel a little bit safer about leaving base. But yeah, we got a couple autos. Sorry that some of the parts are going to have music. A lot of the parts on um, the AC was on, and I did not realize that it was blaring so loud in the background. So I know in certain parts you're barely going to be able to hear me, but I tried to mix it up with a little bit of music and a little bit of my voice to kind of hopefully fade out the AC. AC in the background a little bit. I know there's some parts where you can't hear her. We were playing in the same room and she wasn't actually in the uh, voice chat or anything. So sorry about that as well. But yeah, we finally got a couple autos up. Gonna put a few bullets in them just to feel a little safe. I mean, this was just like 30 minutes to an hour into the server. Like, there's not too many people that's gonna be running this with flak or anything anytime soon. So we're gonna get some more turrets up. We're gonna get hopefully an industrial forge as soon as possible. But yeah. 
so we went to finally try to tame up this rhino I kept uh, it was out in front it was kind of tormenting me it was out front of the cave I really wanted it it was a high level it would have been good for PvP and stuff early game but as you can tell in a second didn't go as planned I don't know why I used wood thinking I could knock it out in time but I did and then yes yeah that happened So we went and we tried a PvP, we were trying to get a tribe to come out, but they clearly was not having any part of it. They even named a uh, repair sword go away. And yeah, I couldn't really get this tribe to come out in PvP. So uh, my goal was to go back and craft some grenades and blow in. Not really raid them, but at least get them out because, you know, I wanted a little bit of PvP. Fresh bite PvP is always the best. And yeah, this is what happened. I went back and got the grenades and I ended up seeing the guy outside for literally a split second before he decides to run off and not PvP. Server kind of lagged a little bit and yeah, then he just kind of ran back in base. So my goal was to take the grenades and blow in, but the guy actually, he outsmarted me. He made his way into the base. I couldn't find him. He could detect me and then when I went to go in, they actually placed a heavy down, or a, I mean an actual turret at the entrance, so I couldn't get in there and blow that now because all I had was grenades. So it was time to move on to the next tribe and try to PvP with them and hopefully they will actually PvP. So we made our way over to the Silica Pearl Cave on center and we ended up seeing a griffin outside. The guy landed and i was going to just kill it and hopefully they'd come out in pvp actually i figured they would actually get on it before but yeah my whole goal was just get somebody out to pvp i didn't really know how big this tribe was but they did have a lot of metal foundations and stuff already outside and this is usually a bigger tribe's base spot so yeah the whole goal was to kill the griffin get them to come out pvp kill them get a few kits and you know, set them back a little bit, but we'll see if that goes as planned. It ended up much that I couldn't actually do because the wyvern, once it kind of sprayed me, I was pretty much dead at that point. I was not expecting another wyvern, but I ended up spawning up, getting back to my RG, and yeah. Let's just say I kind of pushed my luck. I don't know why I just didn't dip, but I mean, it was just an RG. I went in PvP, kind of got PvB, but I kind of got uh, my butt clapped in a way. <laughs> So I went out looking for PvP and I got destroyed and you know I'm not ashamed of it. It was fun. I gotta kill the griffin and stuff. Kind of enjoyed it, but yeah, you'll see what happens.
we needed some quick charcoal so we decided to go over to crystal isles to you know the uh burnt trees and just get a little bit of charcoal for that early game ammo gunpowder all of that we need to get some more ammo in our turrets didn't really feel like waiting for the forges all day so figured by then we could just get some charcoal this way and then we'll put some wood in the forges it'll smell as it goes or it'll turn into charcoal and then we'll get the industrial forge and be set that was the game plan so we were farming up a lot of charcoal throughout the day we ended up finding a deodon so my tribe member decided to hold it up so we can get it tranked out because we're going to need to start healing up some stegos and stuff for base defense if somebody fobs and raiding anybody that tries to mess with us so we wanted to get the deodons and start breeding those up you know get their food all held up so we can start healing all the soakers and stuff and yeah i figured it'd be a good thing to have in the base pretty early game and we were going to go get some stegos and all of that We, end up, we ended up getting this bad boy knocked out, so it's time to tame it up, and hopefully it comes out with pretty good stats, but I think that's where we're going to end today's video. This is uh, quite a bit into the day. Um, we're going to end it here, and yeah, hopefully you guys are excited about the new series. Hopefully you are excited about the server. If you are new around here, please subscribe, like the video, make sure to join the server, and yeah, I'm going to try to get back into uploading as much as I can. Thank you guys for all the support, and I will see you guys in the next video.